Nur Salam is an association for HIV positive patients in Tigray. The association was founded in 2009 and has more than 300 members. Abdullah Ahmed, a founder and chairman of the association, says Nur Salam had previously been working with different local and international organizations that provided them with financial and material support. However, says the chairman, the association is currently in a dire situation as no budget has been allocated to them since the start of the war on Tigray in November of 2020. We used to work in collaboration with Tigray Bureau of Health and other local associations in Tigray. We also used to get financial and material support from them. Currently we don't have any budget. The aid we used to get from the Global Fund has been terminated by the federal government two years ago. The local NGOs themselves are facing a lot of problems at the moment as well. According to Abdul Wasa, members of the association find themselves in an unbearable condition as they are unable to access medical care. Currently, our main problem is the issue of medicine. For example, I had been forced to discontinue my medication for about two weeks as I couldn't find it in the health center nearby. Our members are suffering from lack of food and medicine due to ongoing siege that has blocked the delivery of food and medical supplies. The chairman also adds that the lack of medical supplies had forced members of the association, including himself, to switch medications, further deteriorating their health condition. I used to take medication called 1J, but I was forced to switch to another one called 1A. The medication that I am currently using is causing me a lot of problems. It has made it difficult for me to walk as it hurts my hips and my legs. Abdullah also calls to the international community and the concerned bodies to help alleviate the suffering of HIV-positive patients in Tigray. Our association is found in dire situation and our members are suffering from lack of food and medicine. I call on any concerned body for help as we are in a very devastating condition.